What's up guys, Retro Gamer Steve back with another video and tonight's video is a pickups video. Now it is a small pickups video, not a lot of stuff in the last week, um, but a few uh, cool items. So without wasting any time, let's check out what items I picked up. All right guys, so first I'm gonna start off with a couple items my great friend, um, Iowa Retro Gamer Dad sent me. Um, an unexpected package arrived today and I opened it up and lo and behold, there are two of these miniature cabinets inside. The first one being Asteroids. Super awesome. I uh, was not expecting this at all, but uh, my birthday is next Friday, so I will consider this an early awesome birthday present. So Zach, I really appreciate it. Guys, if you are not yet subscribed, Go check out Iowa Retro Gamer Dad. He's got a great channel. He's an awesome dude. Um, just go check him out, sub, tell him I sent you. Uh, so here's an Asteroids cabinet. And then also a Rampage cabinet. Uh, this one does not have batteries in it right now, but... Very awesome love these things and then he also sent me a tops card that's a donkey kong scratch off and a donkey kong 64 uh instruction manual which was very awesome of him so thank you very much zach i appreciate that buddy and i picked up a couple of switch games the first one is a gamestop exclusive and that is a new copy of sean the sheep Home Sheep Home, Farmageddon. Just, this just looked like a really cute game, so I picked it up and added it to the uh, massively growing Switch collection. And then another game I finally picked up that my girlfriend is a huge fan of, and that is The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Complete Edition. And of course, this one is also brand new. This has all the additional DLC. And then I picked up a game for the TurboGrafx-16, which as you guys all know is the king of shooters. So I had to pick up one of the best considered shooters overall, and that is Blazing Lasers. I just pick this or just got this in so I need to give the case a little bit of a clean but it's in good shape and this is just an awesome awesome shooter and my girlfriend and I love that genre of games so love picking up turbo games as well and then the last three items I've picked up are all for the Sega Saturn. I have been expanding my Saturn library lately. One of them is an uncommon game, and that is Manx TT Superbike. And these are all complete and great shape. So this is obviously a racing Superbike game. Super fun. And the Saturn was not really known for the 3D graphics, um, but this was actually done really well. Uh, Saturn was is really best for their 2D graphics and big sprites, but this is a really fun game. And again, uncommon. Then I picked up another game, which is a classic for the Saturn, and that is Estal. Now this is a 2D um, platforming action or 2D action platformer where you are Astal and you are trying to save your girlfriend, uh, the princess, and you have this bird that follows you around. You can send the bird to go out and do things for you, grab things. Um, this is the one Saturn game that does not have the label or the name on the side of the spine for some strange reason. 
uh, but this is just a really beautiful game with big sprites and uh, it's a really fun game really really fun and really pretty so definitely glad I picked that one up and then the last game I picked up is also like I said a Saturn game and this is very uncommon to rare and that is Courier Crisis and this is a beautiful copy of the game this uh, is basically Crazy Taxi on a bike uh, this came out before Crazy Taxi did and so th this is a super addicting game I have just been having a great time playing this game so you ride a bike around town and you have to grab packages from one person and deliver them to somebody else crazy taxi style you can jump vehicles you can punch and kick people uh, you can flick people the bird you uh, can have dogs attack you and all kinds of other animals the police if you flick somebody off the police will come after you um, and it is just a super crazy super fun game it's got rock music playing in the background just like crazy taxi does uh, super, like I said, super highly addictive, and I've been playing the crap out of this since I got it the other day, so, um, very uncommon to rare game, and, uh, super happy that I was able to pick up a super clean copy, and definitely growing my Saturn collection here lately, so, those are my pickups, guys, for this week, plus the, um, a few of the things that uh, Zach, Iowa Retro Gamer Dad, sent me, and that's it. All right, guys, so again, I want to thank you, Zach. Um, that was very awesome of you to send me those. Uh, I actually have the Pac-Man one that goes with those, so now I have three of those miniature um, arcade cabs, and uh, that's really awesome. So thank you so much for that um, package. I really appreciate it. I'm going to consider that an early birthday uh, gift because my birthday is next Friday so um, I will be 43 years young next Friday <clears throat> crazy so anyways um, I hope you guys enjoyed the few things I picked up this week if you did and you're not yet a subscriber think about hitting that subscribe button for me guys and give me a big thumbs up that really helps small channels like mine grow and gain traction and if you do enjoy content like this make sure you come back next Monday for my handheld game of the week next Friday for a pickups video or a collection video and then of course every other Wednesday for my home held gaming series and then I drop a random video now and then as well so keep your eyes peeled guys so thank you for watching I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend and until next week take care and keep gaming